Joe Bugle knows they're tired in Phoenix of hearing about effort and hard work. They want to see some wins in the win column. They have the feeling that uh, suddenly there's going to be a bunch of them in a row. Maybe not this season, but they're definitely a, a team growing in stature. And they believe in themselves. Second and ten. Walker with a big hole this time. First down to the 39. Over the 100-yard mark. Freddie Joe Nunn came way back to get him. I talked to Randall Cunningham about Herschel Walker, and he said, the more I give the ball to Herschel Walker, the more pumped up he gets, the more excited he gets. He says it's visible in the in the huddle. He said, I, I just want to keep on handling the ball, and something's going to happen. You know what happened here? He gets over his 100 yards. He has two big runs, 20 rushes, 111 yards. No more squawking from Herschel Walker. They have a first down at the 38-yard line. Saw that Detroit score go by. Sanders, 122 yards and two touch touchdowns in that game. And they're going to use up the clock here. You know, Tim, I'll be honest with you. I really wanted the Phoenix Cardinals to score in that last drive, and I'll tell you why. Because I wanted to see what kind of an Eagle team this really is right now. I mean, they, they got a good test here today, and what they got was great defense. That's what held them in. The Eagle defense did the whole job here, and they gave them the win. I wanted to see what that offense was going to do after they put some points on the board. Well, that's been the case really throughout the season, even though they had that dazzling night against Dallas, both ends of the ball. Still, it's been the uh, defense that's carried them. They do have two offensive tackles out, and Keith Byers out of the lineup today. But I think there are some proper uh, skeptics about the Eagles defensively. Well, that's going to finish it up. 21 seconds and counting down. A game display by the Cardinals, but again, game display that results only in yet another defeat. The Cardinals take the loss back, and some good words there between Bugle and Kotite for the Eagles, of course. An important win as they head into Dallas next week. They're now at 5-2, and two, and they did not want to go in there at 4-3 and three with the Cowboys getting the jump on them atop the NFC East. So the final score here in Philadelphia, Eagles 7, the Cardinals 3. Stay tuned for the NFL Today post-game show. Greg and Terry with all the scores and highlights of today's action. You've been watching CBS Sports coverage of the National Football League.